Hi guys and welcome back for another video. So it's been a while since you were last in my bedroom but I'm now back at home for summer. I have picked up six prom dresses from Dress Lily which is basically a website where they do really good value dresses um, of all different shapes and styles, lots of different colours. If you saw my last prom video then you'd know that I, I like cheap things, I like good value things um, and I didn't want to spend any more than 20 quid on my actual prom dress so I thought it would be quite useful for you guys to see how these dresses fit and what they actually look like and if you have your own prom coming up then maybe this might give you some ideas. So the first dress is this lovely black long ball gown with this gold detailing on the bottom. It's like the sequin mesh lace part. It has a really beautiful trail and it's nice and figure hugging. However, this is made for someone who is about six foot tall and me being a very medium sized Asian means that I'm actually quite a small sized woman so even with my tallest pair of heels this still does actually drape on the floor but the quality is actually really good I got this in a size small and I will be leaving all the links and stuff in the description box below so if you're looking at dresses then check them out I think this is quite a classy dress and the off-the-shoulder look means that you can show off your decolletage and make it look quite beautiful so thumbs up the next dress is by far the most comfiest ball gown dress I have ever tried on. It's this really stretchy soft cotton material, it's not scratchy or anything like that at all. It has really nice comfy spaghetti straps and it's not tight around the tummy so if you are going to eat some nice food at your prom then you can definitely fit it in in this dress. The one thing I would say about this dress is the netting over the top of the skirt can look a little bit creased so you might need to iron it but I don't think we actually own an iron in this house but putting it in a hot shower might have to do. And with a pair of heels this is a really good height because I'm around five foot five so it just about graces the floor as I walk by. The next dress is a little bit similar but it is of satin blue material rather than a light grey kind of colour. Again it has some really beautiful sequin details at the top um, and it has a spaghetti straps and it's a low cut back as well so a little bit saucy. The one thing I'd say about the material is that it's quite thick so it's not real satin silk um, it looks really shiny and glossy on camera which is great for photos but it's not like you want to sleep in this it's so soft and silky like a nice set of satin pajamas I don't think I'm actually gonna have the opportunity to wear all of these dresses so if you're going to prom and you're a size small around five foot five and you want to have this dress let me know in the comments below and um, I'm happy to send this to you if you're in need of a prom dress because I yeah I don't want to I don't have enough space in my wardrobe for all of this, so just let me know. The next dress is a lovely tan shimmery sequin one. Um, what I like about this one is the loose back, so it looks really, really elegant from behind. It is a little bit long again, and I think it's made for people who have longer legs rather than a longer torso, which I have. Um, so the slit comes a little bit high up my thigh, maybe slightly too revealing. My hips are also quite round so I wouldn't say this is the most flattering dress for me. Again it has a really beautiful trail so you do feel quite princessy when you wear it um, and if you are in need of a beautiful tan sequin prom dress and you're maybe a little bit taller than five foot five um, and you've got long legs and a shorter torso in proportion then I'd say this is the perfect dress for you. Let me know in the comments if you want it and I will send it to you. The next dress I wouldn't necessarily call prom but I would wear it to the theatre or to a nice fancy meal. I wore it on my birthday um, and it is actually the dress I'm wearing at the moment. It's a black chiffon dress and it has sleeves. The sleeves almost have this polka dot effect and it has the lace down the sides with a little bow at the end and I think it just looks really classy. So um, this dress doesn't have much shape to it so the one one thing I did add was this silver and black belt from H&M just to add a bit more shape into my waist and then let it flow out at the end. I was a little bit worried that it was slightly funerally but with some nice white Stan Smiths um, or just some classic white trainers I thought this might look a little bit more happy and a little less morbid. Now the final dress was a little bit of a risk. I saw it on Dress Lily and I thought you know what when am I going to get a chance to try a salsa kind of you know that emoji that emoji I thought this is just like that. I wouldn't find this dress along the high street so I thought why not go for it and see what it looks like. I wouldn't say this is the most flattering on my body shape. I do like the floral cut out frills but the material is a little bit scratchy, it's not really soft. 
It came with this kind of ribbon thing, which I'm not sure whether I was to tie around my neck or my waist. I think this might be a charity shop job, but if you're looking for a nice salsa dress, if you've got a party coming up with a salsa theme or um, something beginning with S theme, then maybe, maybe this is a dress for you. Just let me know in the comments and I'm happy to send it to you. I think it's just the cut of the dress and these frills don't look very frilly. They kind of look creased and um, a little bit limp and lifeless, but red is often a very striking colour and looks nice on pretty much all skin tones. So there we have all six dresses that I got from Dress Lily. If you liked any of them, make sure that you check the description box below. Comment down below which one was your favourite. Don't forget to subscribe for weekly videos on this channel and I will see you next week. Have a lovely day. Bye!